guys, Bailey here, and today I'm coming back with another concert diary. I went to a Memphis Mayfire concert last night, and it was so much fun, so I'm going to tell you all about it and show you some videos and pictures that I got and stuff. And if you are not subscribed already, you can subscribe, and then you can become a Baileyan. And give it a thumbs up if you want more concert diaries, because I think they're so much fun, and I love going to concerts, and this is just a nice way to remember what happened. So yeah, here we go! To be honest, I didn't know the first band before this. I think they were Astraeus. I didn't know them. Anyway, they were really awesome. I really liked their set. They were really cool. They had really upbeat, fun music, and it was just great. It was a good time, but I was in the back at this point, and so I was actually with my brother and my mom. My mom <laughs> stayed in the very back, and my brother and I were kind of trying to get closer up. The whole time the first band was on there, we were in the very back and not really getting anywhere, and we couldn't see hardly anything. Um, I especially couldn't. There was like this really tall guy right in front of me so I couldn't see anything and then I realized there was like a space so we went forward a bit and then we were in that space and then I saw another space I was like hey let's go up there and he's like you first my brother he didn't want to go first so I just did and I was like moving forwards and then we ended up being like really close to the front there were like four people in front of us most of the rest of the show which was really cool so the next band that came out was Revision Revised and they were like insane they were so good to like get everybody hyped because everyone was hyped for the rest of the show they were like telling people like come on stage stage dive, whatever, um, kept telling people to open the pit, it was crazy, everyone was having fun, and, oh <laughs> wait, I forgot, so my brother, he's 14, he didn't know what was going on, and people started moshing, like, right against us, and behind us, and he literally made this face, like, what the heck is wrong with those guys, and it was just really funny, and I started laughing, because it was hilarious, yeah, after that, we went to the side a bit more, so we weren't, like, right in the middle of it, then a guy stage dived right where we were, but the people in front of us didn't really lift him, so he didn't get to crowd surf. He just kind of fell directly after he jumped off the stage So it was kind of sad, but it was fine But yeah, lots of fun. Second band was great And then the third band that came out was Awake at Last and they were awesome I'm pretty sure that the song they opened with was Purgatorium and that's my favorite song by them So I was really excited about that and they were a lot of fun too I really liked their set and the next band that came out was Fire from the Gods They were awesome. Everyone was really pumped for them and and let me just say the lead singer in Fire from the Gods, AJ, is so tall. Like, he is way taller than I thought he was gonna be. I don't know how tall he is, but he just seemed really tall. When they were done, everyone was chanting, one more song, one more song, and then they, like, didn't come back. People were still, like, taking down their stuff and everything, and they were kind of just not coming back. And then people kept chanting, one more song, and they started adding please to the end, so it was like, one more song, please. And it was just really funny, and they didn't come back. But then, Memphis Mayfire came out! It was actually so crazy. So right in front of me was Kellen and it was really cool. Just up there, like two people in between us doing his thing. It was really awesome. And um, the whole time I was literally just thinking like, how are these people real? Like I, it's so weird because I have seen like their music videos and I've seen like interviews of them and then it's like they're actual real people. That always happens when I go to concerts, but it's like, I don't know how to explain it otherwise. Crazy that they're like right in front of me and they're actual humans. So I was so happy with all the songs they were playing. It was so much fun. I was singing along and jumping. It was awesome. And then they actually played Miles Away and I didn't think they were going to because I know it's like one of their more popular songs, but it's also like kind of slower and also I don't think it's been on their set list recently. I kind of looked and I didn't see it. So I didn't think they were going to play it and then they did because uh, Maddie was like, hey, we're going to actually play a slower song now and everyone like knew what song he was talking about and then um, it was awesome. We sang Kellen Quinn's part in like the bridge of the song, so that was cool too. It was just awesome. I loved it so much. And my phone actually was full of storage. I got them coming out on stage and then after that it filled up, which is my fault. I was just being dumb. I should have made sure that I had enough room on my phone to take more pictures and videos and stuff, but I didn't. So then my brother actually let me use his to get uh, Miles Away, so I got some of the end of Miles Away. It was really cool. And then when they had a few more songs to go, he was like, uh, after this we're going to try to hang out and meet as many of you guys as we can. At that point, my brother was kind of, I don't even know, he was like really hot and sick I think it was just a mess so I was like okay we can go I guess um because they already played a bunch of my favorite ones there were still some songs that I really wanted to hear but I could still hear them from the back it was fine so then I uh, took him back to uh, our mom so that he could feel better and then I actually saw that there were a bunch of the other guys from the other bands and they were hanging out at their merch table so I just went and said hi to them and told them they did a great job and took some pictures with I took a picture with the singer from Awake at Last and Revision Revised and I bought a t-shirt from Memphis Mayfire I got this this one that has the dates on the back. And by the way, there's my date, Charleston, West Virginia. I just want to say how cool it was that they came to West Virginia. 
because it's really weird that a bigger band comes to West Virginia because a lot of people don't even know West Virginia exists. So it's just really cool. It was really cool and it was still a little bit of a drive for me, but like not as bad as where I normally have to go, where it's like I normally have to go to like Columbus or Raleigh or Charlotte or something or Pittsburgh. So the fact that they came a lot closer and to my state is really, really cool. So I hope more bands do that and I hope they come back. The crowd was so amazing and I think that all the bands were like really amazed and wanted to come back because it was just awesome and I hope that they do. I hope that a lot more bands come to West Virginia because it's really cool, especially like rock bands and stuff. It's awesome. So they had the sign at the door of the venue and there was a security guard like standing right there at the door and I was like, uh, is it cool if I take this? And he made this face like, and I was like, yeah, but like it's, it's almost over anyway and he was just Ah, whatever, and then I took it, so it's cool. So all of that was happening while they were doing like their last couple songs, and then we just kind of hung out for a bit while tons of people were leaving, and I was really surprised that more people didn't like stick around to like meet them and stuff. We just hung out, and we were first hanging out with a merch table, and then we went and sat back where the stage was at, but like kind of towards the back, just sitting and chilling and waiting. And then one of the guys who was like a tech guy or a roadie or something for Memphis Mayfire, who was really, really nice, he like was getting some of their stuff and like rolling it back out from the venue to their trailer, and he was like, thank you guys so much for coming out, we want to do this again. And we were like, thanks, it was awesome. And I was like, hey, is um, Memphis Mayfire going to be meeting people because I wanted to meet them? And he was like, yeah, I don't know, were they by their merch table? I said no. And he said, oh, I'll go check outside and see if they're busy taking down or if they're meeting people, I'll see what's going on. And I was like, oh, thanks. And then he went out and brought the stuff and came back and said, yeah, they're actually meeting people, you can follow me, there's like 20 people ahead of you and then you can meet them. And I was like, what? That's so cool. And the only one who was actually meeting people was Maddie, um, which is still fine. And I was amazed just to meet him because it was just awesome and I did not expect to meet them at all so it was really really cool so then when we were in line it actually moved pretty quickly and he was so so nice so when we were like walking up he said something like thank you guys so much for coming out it's nice to meet you and then I was like hi I'm Bailey and we hugged and he was like Bailey nice or something like that and then really quickly I said I was so excited when you guys played miles away because I didn't think you were going to it's one of my favorite songs and I was just really happy when you guys played it and he was so nice he was like yeah it was for you I saw you out there and I was like we have to sing it for her and then I probably like squealed or something honestly cuz that's what I do and then Maddie was going in for the picture and I was like actually can we do two pictures like one regular picture and then one we were like back to back and he was like oh yeah and so then we took both the pictures and he was like it was so nice meeting you and I said actually can you sign this and um, it was the flyer that I got and he signed it right here I was like you can sign wherever you want he's like ah oh, this looks like a good place and he signed it he actually had a sharpie prepared which was great because I was worried he wouldn't have anything to sign it with and then I took my brother's picture with him and then when my mom was kind of walking away at this point he turns to her and he's like oh are you mom I'm Maddie and he shook her hand and it was just really nice that he pointed out mom and mom was happy about that and we were leaving I was like thank you so much and then he was like thanks for coming out see you next time god bless and then whenever we turned away from him I was just like I don't know how to describe it like you know that thing where you're like screaming but like internally but your body is still doing that thing like you're so excited I did that like <laughs> yeah I don't know that's pretty much it but yeah it was a lot of fun I really enjoyed it and I hope I can see Memphis Mayfire again on their next tour or something but yeah thank you for watching this video and I'll see you guys next time bye